The Conservative MP for Shipley, Philip Davis, is facing criticism and a social media backlash for a speech he made a month ago at a men's rights conference. The conference was organised by the Justice for Men and Boys Party, which intends to field candidates in the next general election. In his speech, Mr Davis said he didn't believe there was a problem between men and women, only one being stirred up by, and I quote, militant feminists and politically correct males who pander to this nonsense. Let's hear a little more of that speech. Generally, there seems to be a deafening silence on all the benefits women have compared to men. In this day and age, the feminist zealots really do want women to have their cake and eat it. They fight for their version of equality on all the things that suit women, but are very quick to point out that women need special protections and treatment on other things. Well, that last comment has prompted women to put pictures of themselves up on social media eating cake with the hashtag let them eat cake. We can speak now to uh, Philip Davis. Um, Do you stand by your comments? Yes, I was just making uh, the point about the justice gender gap, which is the figures are are perfectly clear. They're facts. They're not opinions. They're facts. Uh, So, for example, um, 61% of men who who were convicted of robbery are sent to prison. Only 37% of women who are convicted of robbery are sent to prison. Uh, 33% of men who are sentenced for child cruelty are sent to prison. Only 15% of women are sent to prison. For every single category of offence, a man is more likely to be sent to prison than a woman. They're going to send long, spend longer in prison uh, than a woman. And uh, these are facts. These, these are from the, the official figures from the Ministry of Justice. They're not opinions. Um, and, you know, I believe in equality. And, and for me to say, say that uh, I think that... Uh, the court should be gender blind and if you believe in equality a man should be treated exactly the same in the court as a woman I, I don't really see why that's controversial that's equality well you talked what... about you talked about versions of equality and and yes. you you've just said that that, that that you believe in equality surely there's no yeah. such thing as a version of equality there is just equality well exactly that's my that's my whole point and so my whole point is this is that you, women can't say these sort of feminists can't say on one hand that we believe in equality but actually, when it comes to being sentenced to prison, actually, we want to be treated differently to men because that's, in effect, what they're saying at the moment. They want to be treated differently before the courts when it suits them, but they want to have equality on everything else. And my point is, if you believe in equality, and I believe in equality, and I'm making the case for equality, then you've got to follow that logic through and you've got to say, well, I believe women should be treated by the courts in exactly the same way as men. That's but, true but equality. But way, the way in which you framed the, the facts that you've presented using really quite derogatory language, you describe feminism as very derogatory. You talk about militant feminists and zealots. Do, do you not see feminism as a good thing? No, I, what I see is, is hypocrisy is a bad thing. I believe in equality, and if people want to make the case for equality, as I'm doing, that's great. But that wasn't but my I, question. Do you think feminism is a bad thing? No, feminism's fine if it believes in true equality. That's fine. But what I'm against are these militant feminists. And we've seen today, nobody, the, all, the, all of this uh, social media hysteria, I'm arguing for equality. I'm asking for men and women to be treated the same. Is anyone actually engaging that argument? No. They're, they're hurling abuse. They don't want the debate to be had. They're trying to quieten the debate because they don't really believe in equality. What they believe in is for women to have equality when it suits them, and they believe in women not being having equality when it doesn't suit them. And so you can't have it both ways. You've got, you either believe in equality in everything or you don't believe in equality. And I was making the case for equality, and that means, I'm, I'm afraid that women should be treated by the courts in exactly the same way as men. That is what true equality means. You can't pick and choose which bits of equality you want. Philip Davis, MP for uh, Shipley, thank you for joining us.